What is up? Welcome back to the vlogs and the first vlog of 2023. I took a very long, much needed break after Vlogmas because Vlogmas definitely kicked my butt, not gonna lie. It was exhausting doing a vlog every day and trying to come up with content and stuff for you guys. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you did watch Vlogmas, then shout out to you. Thank you so much. It was super fun, but definitely needed a break for the holidays. After that, sorry, there's like a hair in my mouth. There we go that was bothering me but yeah definitely needed a break for the holidays and it was nice to kind of take that time off first time having like holidays in a couple of years now since working retail so it was very very nice just to chillax be off at the same time everybody else was off and not have to work over christmas so i hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season we're back with the vlogs hopefully i'll be able to vlog more now that we're going full time with the content things i decided i wanted to start today's vlog because i have so many errands to do today so i wanted to bring you guys with me we have a couple of returns to do at the mall um, from Lululemon. So I ordered a couple things the other day line for the new releases. And I just wanted to try, these are the lightweight mid-rise shorts in powder blue. They were like cute and all, but I don't know. I just, you have to be mindful about what undergarments you'd be wearing with them because they are like slightly see-through being like more of a light color and stuff. And I just don't know if I'm going to wear them that much in the summer. Like, I don't know. And plus they weren't like that mid-rise. I did do like a try on and stuff for TikTok and a whole review. So you can check that out if you have TikTok. But overall, I just don't think I'm going to like wear these that much over the summer. So I'm probably like, obviously well no i am going to return them because that's why we're going to the mall and then i also got the sunset hottie hots because i love the color online but in person they're way more orange and way brighter than i thought they were going to be so yeah i didn't i don't love this i definitely thought it was going to be more like raspberry cream but like lighter and like more pink this one's definitely more orange and i'm not really an orange yellow girl so honestly i just don't really see See myself wearing these unfortunately these colors together though look super cute I don't know I'm just trying to be more mindful of like spending and stuff this year and just getting and keeping things that I really like will wear and love especially without an employee discount it definitely makes things a lot more expensive so that's the plan also need to go to Best Buy return this mouse pad did not work for my mouse it did not like track the mouse thing it made it super difficult so bought that did not work gotta go return that need to go to staples pick up a photo need to go to michael's get a photo frame for that photo and then ship that off for my grandma because it's a late christmas gift and we need to go grocery shopping today i think damon's parents are coming over for a dinner tomorrow so we need to pick up some like wine and stuff and dinner items and what else do i need to do i think that's it but that's still like a lot of errands to do today so let's get started <laughs> Okay, I think we'll go over to like Best Buy, Michaels, and Staples first and then head to the mall. Kind of wanted to head to the mall first, but I feel like it just makes more sense to do it the opposite way. Plus, Best Buy doesn't open till 11, but I feel like the other two errands will take up enough time anyway. So, we're going to go do that first and then head to the mall. I know it's Friday, so hopefully it's not too busy. Okay, that took way longer than I thought to just pick up the one photo, but it was so busy. And then I needed a little mailing bubble envelope as well. So I'm just looking for some whiteboard markers since mine dried out and basically broke. So options are looking limited. Honestly, don't even know the last time I've like been in a Michaels. I don't really do crafts. So I have no idea where anything is. Just kind of wandering aimlessly. 
Okay, I found some frames, but I definitely thought they had some more affordable options. This one's $7.50. So I'm debating if I want to drive to Ikea to like get some frames there, but then I don't know if that's worth it in like gas money. So I don't really need anything else at Ikea. So maybe I'll just get this one. It will be fine, I'm sure. And then, yeah, I don't know. They have so many frames, so many options, but it is a five by seven photo. So I think this one will work. Okay, that took way longer than expected. I was being indecisive as heck in my goals. Plus, I was getting like overwhelmed. I don't know. Just not like an arts and crafts person. So, that store is just really overwhelming and confusing to me. But now we have to run to Best Buy. Running a little bit behind schedule than I would like to be, but that's okay. Hopefully, we will get everything done anyways. decided to stop at Chachi's to get a pickle because they sell like those giant kosher pickles. This one's way bigger than I thought. They're usually pretty good so this is like my lunch. <laughs> oh my god. This is giant but this is going to be my lunch and snack. I love pickles so. Really good. They also just opened a new like pastry place. Looks pretty interesting but Definitely getting a lot of stairs because there's a lonely girl in the mall sitting by herself, talking to a camera, eating one giant pickle. All right, we are home obviously now. You saw I made a smoothie. I just put guava juice, mango, and then we had like a tropical fruit blend with like, um, what is it? Passion fruit, pineapple, and dragon fruit in it. So that's what's in here. Made the perfect amount. Love when I do that. Mm. So good. I wanted a frozen yogurt at the mall, but it was really dang expensive, so it was like $8 for a frozen yogurt. And I said, no, let's go home and just make food at home. So that's what we did. Pretty unsuccessful at the mall. I don't know. I felt like shopping, but not shopping, like window shopping, I guess. So found a lot of things that, ooh, maybe I'd like, but I want to think on it. So added just everything to like a wish list online and then I'll go back and maybe purchase it later. But I didn't vlog a lot in the mall just because I feel like it wasn't that busy today. So the store associates were like really hands-on and like asking if I needed help and like, so I just didn't want to vlog because it just makes me super awkward. But I'm going to eat some leftover pizza I just heated up from the other night. And yeah. Right, we've... No, we don't need cashews. Ooh, pomelos. Oh, there's only four in there? Jeepers. Anyways, we came back to the store because we gotta do... No, we're not getting that. <laughs> we're doing a little bit of grocery shopping. I did most of it the other day at a different store, so we're only picking up a few things. But now we're getting distracted. But we're bringing you guys along for a little grocery shop and then trying to convince Damon to go for some ice cream after. is honestly so expensive now. I don't even know what we're here for. $6.99, oh my god.
All fruit cups. Two sixty nine. What? Yeah, because they were on sale last week. Yeah, that's weird. Okay, I didn't know picking out freaking. Okay, but like this one's the same. This fruit salad's the same. Yes. Not then buying them individually. 540 mils. I didn't know picking out fruit <laughs> was this difficult. It's still cheaper? Okay, get the fruit cups. Okay, we just need tortillas and yogurt. We want some cotton candy. Oh, it's nasty. Ooh, watermelon. Rainbow Sherbert. <clears throat> so good. Honestly, you can't get the stuff at like the grocery store. You have to get like a hard ice cream shop and this place has so many flavors, but this is hands down my favorite. I get it like every time. But comment down below what your favorite flavor of ice cream is or what's your go-to. Super happy. And Damon's getting a double thick milkshake caramel apple flavor. start to the vlog as you already saw we went for breakfast this morning at a place called galaxy diner just like a cute little diner it's like a 45 minute wait it was pretty busy but typical of a sunday diner brunch place but now we're just walking down 17th ave um which is just like a street in calgary with like lots of little shops and restaurants and stuff just going for a walk after our brunch and yeah went into one shop already they had some really cute things really good stuff for like gifts but that's pretty much what's going on didn't vlog at all yesterday because didn't really do anything exciting so welcome to today all right damon had to stop and get some gas so we got a slurpee nothing more canadian than drinking a slurpee in the winter Call these slurpees in America? Yes. Oh. oh. Yeah, sure. Know. Or do they only call them like ices? Like, don't they have ices? They don't really have like slurpees. Slurpees just a What do you? What do you call these? Frozen drinks. Yeah, that's gas station. Ices. Slurpees. We say slurpees. Hey guys, it is now the next day. Sorry, I didn't vlog anything else yesterday. We honestly did not do anything else exciting we literally came home i had a nap damon played zelda for like the rest of the afternoon and we had leftovers for dinner so really it was an uneventful weekend but i'm going to end the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed the little clips that i did get and i'll be starting a new vlog very soon so i hope to see you in that one be sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you are notified when i post new content but i'll see you in the next one bye guys